I can't believe I have to, to do the dang card flip game in the next part. It actually made me split it. But anyway, here is the next piranha plant of death. Alright, oh no. Oh god. Look at that, it's one block jumps! They want me to do one block jumps! Yeah. <laughs> These are nuts! I don't like these stages. Well, uh, ooh, note, note, note. Okay, wait, that was it? That was that was a stage? Oh, well, that wasn't scary at all, actually. Mushroom! Look at them! They're hungry. Yummy! I want Mario. They're saying, but they don't get any Mario. Where does this pipe take me? Oh wait, 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 wait! I remember, I remember. It uh, it was a locked door uh, pipe before before I got to it, but. Now it's not, so let's ignore it. Oh my god, they transformed the king into Droggy Yoshi! How could they do such a thing? They now gave the king a drug addiction. <sighs> the king is gonna have to go to go to rehab after this one. Well anyway, here it is. The airship. World 7. Oh god, no! <laughs> this is just mean. I'm just gonna go like this. <laughs> I think that's safer than trying to get that dang nut to go with me. And what's in here? It's another fire flower. I was hoping for a, um... Uh, what's the... Uh, what's the name? Uh, the leaf. The raccoon. <laughs> oh, oh, I do not like these kinds of dangerous jumps! And they're long, too! Always oh, gotta have a good running start to get through them. Oh god, Rocky Wrench! You're going down! Oh wait, can't I get up here? Yes I can! Oh, but I'm gonna fail! Oh wait, I made it up there! And another Fire Flower. Well, that was worth it! <laughs> that was worth the mini heart attack I had. Uh oh, uh oh, oh, that one's going high. I can live with that. And I don't even have to touch that nut. Thank god! <laughs> Uh, there's gonna be a rocky wrench here. I seen that because there's a little hole and these are the weirdest ships I've ever seen. These just aren't practical. Who makes ships like this? Just look at this. It's just a propeller and some nuts. This one doesn't even have a propeller. It's just got nuts. How is it floating? It's wood and metal. This drops like a rock. In fact, it wouldn't even sink because of the metal attached to it. Oh, this is, I mean, it wouldn't even float because of the metal attached to it. What kind of bolts are these things? Well, anyway, rant over and yeah. Whoa. Careful with those. Remember when you touch the nut, immediately jump off it. Otherwise, you're gay. <laughs> I kid, I kid. And we got, I think Ludwig is the name for this one. Oh, he's got a poundy, poundy attack. Oh, he popped out as I was right touching him, and he, oh, there we go, three hits for the win. Give me that one, and let's finish World 7. <laughs> Level cleared. Actually, that wasn't that bad of a ship, but World 8 is coming up, and oh my god, do I have trouble with World 8. World 8 destroys me! Or so I remember. I used to think that World 7 destroyed me, but I did World 7 in two and a half parts. <laughs> well, actually, I did it in more like three parts, because I did part of World 7 at the end of, like, uh, oh, yo, I kidnapped a princess while you were running around! She saved her in my castle. If you dare try to rest, <clears throat> if you dare try and rescue her, <laughs> King of the Koopas. Hey, why didn't you just write Bowser? I think that would have been a little bit, um, you know, you would have saved ink instead of just writing King of the Koopas. But I suppose in Japan he is known as Koopa, but he's known as Bowser here. But still, that would only be the same amount of letters. So why would they? He, why would he want to write his whole name anyway? Anyway, this is World Eight, the Lava World. We are now tanking it up. These tanks are nasty beyond belief. There are bob bombs, there's bullets, there's cannonballs, and as you know, these kinds of cannons do not stop firing when you're standing on top of them. And why the heck is there a burner in front of the cannon? 
It would make more sense if the burner was behind the ship, but no, it's on, it's, it's in the, I mean, if it's in front, uh, excuse me, I can't spit out the right words, and this is a weird looking one here. Anyway, that burner would make a lot more sense if it was behind for propulsion instead of in the front. You'd think that would cause resistance and lower their gas mileage, and you know in this economy, you've got to save wherever you can, and that was a bob on that almost hit me. <laughs> Go away, Rocky Wrench, I do not want your wrenches in my face. If I wanted to buy a wrench, I would go to Sears or something. Maybe Home Depot or something. I don't know. Oh my god! Cannonball of death! That is one massive cannon. Oh! I tried to kill a Rocky Wrench before he hit me, but I failed. Oh, there's the pipe. What's down the pipe? Uh, it's a boomerang, brother. One, two, buckle my shoe! Two! <laughs> okay. That wasn't that bad actually, but I almost took a hit from the boomerang and it almost created a second butt crack from me. I mean for me. So let's save and let's go to an airship. These are called fast airships if I'm not- Oh wait, these. this is actually a boat boat. Oh, this isn't the airship I'm thinking of. Okay, I can deal with that and cannon fire. Oh, it's a mush. I mean a firefly. I don't think that's really worth to take- Oh, maybe it would have been worth taking a hit for. Because I would have um, came back to uh, regular Mario if I would have taken a hit anyway, so... Oh! By the way, that's not lava, it's water. By the way, there's a trick that you can do on this st on stages like this. You can actually jump into the water and swim... Oh! Swim underneath the ship. And completely avoid the entire level, seriously. It's a real cheap way to beat the level. It's like using a pussy wing. <laughs> I think almost everyone has used the pussy. Oh no! Ever, almost everyone has used the pussy wing in the course of them, so, themselves playing Mario 3, including me. <laughs> so, if anything, I called myself a pussy. So, let's go back to that spot that I died at. Okay, I think we're about where I left off, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, I think this was it. Where I took a rocky wrench, then a wrench in my face. I, like a man, oh my god, but yeah, as I was saying, I'm pretty sure everyone has used the P-Wing to beat some ultra hard levels somewhere along the line. It's just natural to do on your first run because you don't know what they do, so you gotta try them out, and then you defeat a level like nothing. <laughs> and, oh, triple cannon fire! Actually, it's quad cannon fire, look at that, look at the bullets go. Actually, they're more like cannonballs, little cannonballs that you can jump on. That is so realistic, I mean, if I was in a war against Bowser's army, I would certainly jump on cannonballs to stop them from hurting me. And it's boom boom! Boom boom, you're going down as usual. Oh, I missed a second hit there. I kind of jumped a little far, but that's okay. You still go down nice and easy, boom boom. Sorry, boom boom, but you will forever fail when I play this game. <laughs> And there goes the ship, and I'm pretty sure you have to go through here. Not the other pipe. We're gonna see in just a second. Uh, okay, yeah, I think this is the right way. Whenever you go down a hill, it seems like you're taking the right way. Okay. Help me, Mario! I need sex! Okay, see these five things that you...